digging in the switch hitter, John Dougherty, starting things. San Diego, shortstop, John Dougherty. Into the windup and the pitch. Ninth Nine. inning underway now as the first pitch is taken for a cold strike. Now action in the bullpen as their closer starts to get loose out there. Ball one. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. And he takes one off the inside corner for ball two. Into the windup, here's the 2 and 1 pitch. Line drive to left. But he'll hardly need to move out there in left as this is called in for the first out. Now batting. So stepping here. in. Doug Lowe. Here comes the Seattle skipper on his way to the mound. And it appears that we've seen the last here in this one of Garrett Cole. So a strong performance here as he worked his way into the ninth, but it let the bullpen late. try and close now with the final two the outs. Soon Juan O enters from the pen to begin the frame with a sizable lead with which to work. Way in front of that fastball. Boy, he is not seeing the ball at all. He's already got three strikeouts. If he strikes out here, that's when you start calling the eye doctor. Waved at and missed, and he's behind 0 and 2. There's a swing and a high drive into left center field. Junior looks up, and this one is gone. A home run. So a solo shot here to left center field. Sixth home run on the season for him, and they're now on the board, though still well behind. Yeah, all things considered, it's been a day to forget for them. So this homer will be a welcome to everyone in that dugout. Maybe this gives them a little momentum going into the next game. Now batting. Digging in at the well, plate is Travis Jankowski. As he'll take a look at the pitch too low, it's ball one. No hits to this point. Sneaks a fastball by him at the letters. It's one and one. Bases are empty. One man out. And this is fouled at the plate. <clears throat> He's right on that breaking ball. That's pretty good timing right there, especially falling up after a fastball. And this is going to find the crowd down the left field line. Count holds at one and two. Well, when you're hitting with two strikes, you're just in battle mode. Right there, he gets a breaking ball. He just fouled it off. Got a piece of it and stays alive. Got him. And that's the third time we've written a K next to his name in this one. Here's Will Myers. He was punched out looking at strike Will three last time Myers. through. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. Looking up is Hedegar. Gone! A solo shot here off the bat of Will Myers. Number 11 for him on the season, but they still face a seven run deficit. Well, when you're down a bunch of runs, you know the last thing they want to do is walk you. So right there, he picks on a good one to hit and plants it right over the wall. And that'll bring up the power hitting middle infielder Ryan Shim. He could really use a knock here 0 for 3 in the game so far. And this is swung on and missed, so the Padres find themselves down to their final strike here. Swing and a miss. He struck him out, and that'll do it here as the ball game is over. Hey, I've given up trying to predict where this amazing streak's going to end, so I'm just going to congratulate them and say, well done. A 9-2 finish at the end of this contest. The Seattle Mariners pick up win number 120, tops in the division. Garrett Cole records his 18th win of the year racking up 14 K's in doing so so that's it for us this afternoon for Harold Reynolds Dan Plezak and our entire crew I'm Matt Vaskersian 
You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, log on to theshownation.com. Our final line score this afternoon, first for the victorious Seattle Mariners. Nine runs on 15 hits. No errors. They left four men on base. For the Padres, two runs on four hits. Three errors. It also left three men on base. Time of the ball game, three hours and 22 minutes. A reminder that extra post-game trains will be available at the King Street Station, located just north of Safeco Field. Metro Transit buses are also available at stations on First Avenue, Royal Brom Way, and Edgar Martinez Drive.